everyone and welcome back to my kitchen. In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to cook risotto, a northern Italian dish. We're going to start with making a very simple vegetable stock and then cook the risotto with it. Finish it off with some sauteed mushroom and parmesan to it. But before we get into it, make sure to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already and ring that bell. Let's do this. First of all, soak puccini mushroom in cold water, leave it for at least half an hour and then sieve it and keep the mushrooms and the stalk separately. We cook the risotto with a stalk. So to make a vegetable stalk, cut vegetables into big chunks. Add them in a pot along with parsley, bay leaves and peppercorn. Fill it with 2.5 liter of water, bring it to a boil and let it simmer for 1.5 an hour. In the meantime, chop the shallots finely and cut the mushrooms into small pieces. See if the vegetable stock after one and a half an hour. Now we have our vegetable stock, porcini mushrooms and the porcini stock of course, chopped shallots and mushrooms ready to go. First, saute the mushrooms, add porcini and toss them for about two minutes and then set them aside. Add some olive oil in a skillet and sweat the shallots. Add the arborio rice and toss them for a few minutes on medium heat. Normally, I add wine at this point, but since the amount of wine we're gonna be using in this recipe is very little, if I add it now, it evaporates in a few seconds. And we don't want that. To prevent that, I'm going to add like a few tablespoons of vegetable stock and cook it to dry. It helps to bring down the temperature a little bit. Now you can add the white wine and let it cook for 2 minutes on medium heat. Add porcini and vegetable stock little by little and keep it stirring until the arborio is cooked. You can find the exact measurement of porcini and vegetable stock used in this recipe on my website and also below the video in the description box. So just follow the recipe and you're gonna be fine.
The risotto is nearly done. Add the sautéed mushroom and continue cooking for another 2 minutes. Add butter and parmesan and toss them together. For the garnish, I've already sautéed some mushrooms and now I'm gonna show you how to make a very simple parmesan twill. Mix flour, water, parmesan and olive oil, pour it in a pan and let it cook on medium heat for a few minutes.